Hey y'all, hey. Good morning, good morning, love bugs. It is your host, Queen of Blama and more. And we are back, y'all, for part two of Queen of Kings Deleted Live, y'all. Rose went live last night ranting about a content creator she decided to work with, and then she turned her back on. That creator has went on to expose everything about Rose and everything they were doing under the cover. You feel me? <laughs> but she deleted it last night, y'all. We got it. Today is October the 29th. It is around 8.30 a.m. The bugs. This video probably will go up around 9 a.m. Y'all make sure y'all smack that like you like button. Make sure you are subscribed to this channel, Queen Blama, and more. Smack the bell notification. Make sure your bell says all not personalized so you're notified any and every time we decide to drop a video or whatever, y'all. So Rose was live. She was drinking her wine. Um, I don't know if Brett was drinking wine or not. Also, he was acting so strange at the end of his live. And then Rose said, like, she was saying that he stink. And she was like, it don't smell like sewer. I think it's Brett. Um, he was working hard today. And I'm just like, what? <laughs> also, she got some braids in her hair, trying to make herself look like champagne. Child, let me go ahead and add Rose to the screen, y'all. I'm going to click play, and we gone. We're going to talk about it. We're going to watch it, and we are going to talk about it, okay? And see what's going on. This is about a 20-minute long reaction. Recording your conversations. That's what she said to my sisters. This video is protected by the... Copyright Disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976. This video is being used for fair use, and we are giving our criticism, our comments, and our commentary on the deleted live. YouTube allows us to do this. I'm going to push play, y'all. And my sister is like, okay, she's a YouTuber. And the girl, Felicia Mann, was like, no, but she's been recording your personal conversations and some things should be private. And then my sisters was like, oh, OK, like my sister. So this is part two of the video, y'all. In part one, Rose goes on to say basically how she met this person and how she ended up working with this person. Rose says that she never agreed to play, pay the person. But Rose does admit to accepting her services. She said the person reached out to her and said, hey, I'm a big investigator for big YouTubers. And Rose said, oh, really? Well, can you give me this, this, and all of that? And the lady got Rose the stuff. And Rose said, she told her, well, I should give you some money for this. But Rose didn't. Rose cut her off. Hmm. I'm a quick play, y'all. That was all in part one. Now we in part two didn't believe so she's just like okay cool and like so then anyways the felicia girl she went on youtube and she's like yeah y'all i got the tea i talked to her sisters and then i guess people started like giving her like like kind of pushback like that's kind of weird why did you call her family why did you call her sisters and then she kind of like reverted back she went back and she was like um oh well did you did she tell you that she called my whole family Girl, you record everything. You didn't record a single family member saying that I called your family. I have four children. I, I, I like real life stuff going on. Why would I, why would I know I don't eat drama up? I don't, I don't fucking like it. You have no idea. If you were going through this, um, Mandy could. I think it's interesting that she says she got four children and she's so busy, but she's not too busy to be up at 4 a.m. striking different channels. And she's not doing legal strikes. It's not like I'm just recording her video and uploading it without putting any reaction to it or anything. No, my video is completely protected by fair use. She don't like the fact that I call out her sexual behavior in front of them boys and I call out her foolery. So she's up in the middle of the night watching my videos and striking them. But she tried to act like she too busy with her four kids to have the this. Girl, we don't put nothing past you. Thank you so much for supporting me. But no, I don't fucking eat it up. 
And I've been quiet. If you look at my content and you look at the content on these other people's pages, I've been very fucking quiet. Very quiet. While people play real life games with my children and my family. Okay, this is somebody getting on Instagram and YouTube. This is the person that's called CPS on me multiple times. Um, moderators, please block and delete. You love drama, block and delete. This is the people that have called CPS on my family multiple times, multiple times. Um, and the same person that has a article, you look up Felicia Mann versus the people. She's she definitely likes the drama. Um, she like it and she right. She's been quiet because she's been sitting back striking channels and trying to get us to disappear. But then she's mad that people say they want to cancel her. So it's okay for her to strike all these channels and actually have channels terminated. She was trying me, but bitch, please. But when they come for you and they say cancel Queen of Kings, it's a problem. Hmm. Lost her children to almost killing them. Let me just show you guys. Felicia Mann. She's literally a maniac. Man versus the people. <laughs> right there. Anybody could look it up. Anybody could look it up. Felicia Mann versus the people. And you click on it. And she literally almost killed her children. Like long, extensive records of her almost killing her children. Killing her children. Killing her children. Killing, almost killing her children. She has about child. It's the fact that she keep repeating that, and YouTube didn't take her video down. I just don't even know, y'all. That is out of control. They would have took our stuff down with the quickness if we keep hollering something crazy like that. Six children, and all of them were taken away, but one little boy. But this is the person that's over there to people to two thousand people saying like, "Uh, save Rose's children." But she lost all of her fucking children. She's real life psychotic. And here in the article, it said after a psychosis analysis, she was deemed unsuitable to be able to take care of the children. After the psychosis analysis, she was deemed un unsuitable to have children in her care. These are the, the person that's going and saying, hey, save Rose children. And then other people like going and believing what she's saying because she has receipts on Rose. It's very sick. It's very, very, very sick and it's not okay. She shared my address. She's called my family members and she's lied and said like, and, and look, my moderators are gonna be pissed because they told me like, be quiet, your people don't like this. Yeah, I know. But this has been three months, three months that I've been dealing with this. She called my apartment complex. Y'all see how she tried to play victim? Talking about three months that she been dealing with it. Three months since you've been dealing with what? Because you've been up late night striking people that are doing reaction. So three months since you've been dealing with what? Everything that's going on, you initiated, Rose. You might not have initiated the original reaction videos, but your response to them definitely added fuel to the fire and you kept going and you kept going just like you was live last night instead of ignoring it and just putting out your videos she called my apartment complex to get my unit number she called my apartment complex and pretended to be me and then put it on youtube that she pretended to be me and called my apartment complex to get my unit number okay so next, the last week I've been going to a school so that I can complete my, become a, her and Brett need to put the alcohol down and leave it down. She mad, mad. She's really banking on a couple of conversations that she's had with me to pretend that I know her 
or that that we had like a relationship or that I knew her. You guys, I went to her Facebook page. Someone sent me and I went to her Facebook page and it was a, a video of Brett and I with Brett spreading my legs open and she had hearts. And that was from March, 2023. She has been obsessed with my husband and I since March, 2023, when she shared a video and put hearts on it of my husband spreading my legs. So now, and yesterday she admitted, she said, I've been watching them way before I talked to her. She said that in her live video. She said, I've been watching them way before I even talked to Rose. She said it in her live video that's still up here on YouTube. Okay. You guys, yesterday I've been doing a real estate class for the past week. <laughs> And so my teacher told me, y'all, Rose is over there really buggy. Okay. She shouldn't have drunk no dang on one. This is so deep. This is like nothing I've ever, ever experienced in my life. I think it's funny. Okay. She got um, this and it's hair still, like I get a psycho, a psychopath, but like the people that are supporting her, like you guys are grown women. Okay. Girl, that is crazy. You got your hair looking like champagne. You really want to be champagne, huh? And she didn't start it back working out, y'all. She really wants to be champagne. You guys, I've been doing a class, a real estate class for the last week. My teacher told me the other day, she said, you pass mm -hmm. your final exam for the real estate class. Now you can go and take your nationals. Mm -hmm. I'm going to send you your certificate of completion because you'll need that in order to be able to take the national exam. That's mm -hmm. what she said to me. So I said, okay. She said, I'll send you the national, I'll send you the certificate within 24 hours. I was waiting for today for Felicia Mann. How exactly did anybody know to contact the teacher? Like, why you keep hopping on here telling your business? To post this so that I can screen record it and take it right to the police. But first, let me show you what Felicia Mann said yesterday. Felicia Mann said this yesterday. God, how do you play the recording? <laughs> this is freaking ridiculous. Uh, Oh God. You you guys can you guys can go to her page. I don't care. Free shout out. You can go to her page. Last night, yesterday, on a live, she said, Hey, I have the receipts of her completing her um class, but I can't show y'all because if I do, she's gonna try to send it to the police and get me locked up and throw away the key. That is exactly what she said. She said she's gonna get me locked up and throw away the key if I show this receipt. That's exactly what she fucking said. And then today she gets on live today and she shows my certificate. Y'all, Rose is talking about a female that she was working with. This female allegedly contacted Rose. Rose said, hey girl, can you get all this information about these people for me? These people are doing reactions on me and I want all their information so I can dox them and do illegal activities. And allegedly, the girl helped Rose out and Rose flipped on her. And now this is where we are. <laughs> and she says, because she just couldn't help herself because that was her receipt. She saw my certificate and she said, hey, y'all, this uh, I got this from Rose's family member. 
I haven't sent this certificate to a single family member on purpose. I haven't sent it to anyone after I found out what Felicia Mann did, what I'm about to show you guys, which is really fucking crazy. <laughs> it's insane. Absolutely insane what she did. Hold on. And I, I, I haven't sent it to a soul. Where is it? Sorry, you guys. I'm not the queen of receipts. I didn't have this prepared. I just. I'll tell you and then I'll show you. Yesterday or the other day. I was waiting for my like all day for my uh teacher to send me so i guess she's finally gonna get in and talking like child that wine got her going y'all and the bottle was already like pretty low honey huh? my certificate so then finally i text my teacher and i said hey it's like almost the end of the day and you still didn't send my certificate i need that in order to take my national exam and then she said she said i sent it to your new email that you told me to send it to i said Chat. what new email what are you talking about <laughs> now my question is nobody should have been able to contact your teacher because no one should have known what you was doing to better yourself no one should have known what you was doing in your spare time so it is still your fault if that happened and she sent me an email she forwarded me an email with a picture of myself that says rose miller and the email said i know i still need 60 hours like she was fishing for information because i don't need 60 hours i already got it she said, I, I know I still need 60 hours, but can you please, I told you about that stalker I have. Can you please send my certificate to this email instead? Because I told you about that stalker I have. Calling my apartment, pretending to be me. Calling CPS, sending them to my kid's school. Making a fake email with even my picture and my first name and last name. And using it to get my personal information. That's incredibly illegal. That's very illegal. That's like really, really super illegal. So I'm gonna show you the email because it makes no sense. It's kind of crazy. So she looking for the email that was allegedly sent to her teacher, y'all. I'm still cracking up about the hair color. She did that on this purpose. Is to my teacher. Updating you. No cert yet. Just need that so that I can schedule my test. She sent me this. Saying. Where is it? Oh, do you know how soon I can expect to receive my cert so that I can schedule my test? Sorry, y'all, my hand is shaking. Good morning, Rose. Sorry, I was so stressed. Oh, what is what is this? Where is it? Oh, are these only the scent? Hold on, y'all. I don't know how this. Did she say, are these only the sent emails? So you sent the email to somebody saying, good morning, Rose. I'm sorry, I'm so stressed out. Mm, child. Rose exposing herself. Sorry. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, there it is. There it is. Sorry. Oh, no, that's not it. Where is it? Oh, I'll send it in, in 24 hours. There it is. I'll switch your course and send the certificate to you within the next 24 hours. And then I waited and I said, hey, you know, oh, that's something else. <laughs> Updating you, no cert yet, just need to schedule my test. Okay, where is she at? Hi, Rose. I sent it to your new email as you requested earlier this morning. Actually sent you two this morning. Let me know if you got them. Dude, my hand is shaking so bad. <laughs> Hi, Rose. I sent it to your email per your request this morning. Okay. So I called her. I said, I'm sorry. What is my new email? I double checked and check the spam as well. I don't see it. So then I called her and said, what are you talking about? New email. And then she, she um, forwarded me this. <laughs> but let me show you guys my email. You see how my email looks. But this is what she forwarded me. It's just really sick. This is my email, right? Look, Rose Miller but it has my actual email one gym is seven and it has my picture, right? My picture. I'm sorry. My hand is shaking so bad. It won't even focus. Hmm. So I start drinking. Let me show you what she got. Oh, Lord, this is that's crazy. She's on here crying, but she was setting up conniving stuff herself. She's literally been out here striking people and trying to shut channels down for no reason. She struck me three times. Legit reaction videos. All of the videos but one have been opened back up because they were legit videos. So for her to sit on here and continuously try to play victim, you are no victim. You are the villain. Let's remove the roach from the screen, y'all. That is the end of our reaction video. As I stated earlier, all of these reactions are protected by the copyright disclaimer under section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976. We are protected by fair use. Hit the like button. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.